So, Ian, why are you standing for Unite during the Secretary? I think members are facing a massive level of attacks from employers on our jobs and our paying conditions, and also from the government in terms of public services and on our rights. And I think though we've got an immense amount to be proud of in Unite, it is falling a long way short of the union we need. My background has been, I've been a workplace activist for the last 25 years, struggling at the coalface trying to tackle all these issues. And uh, I share the experiences and frustrations of members trying to uh, get things done. I think as well I've disagreed with a couple of the key political stances that uh, Len McCluskey's taken. So for example on Trident I think it was a mistake to uh, uh, argue for spending 205 billion on weapons of mass destruction uh, when I think that would have made far more jobs and been far more socially useful to have a million climate jobs, to have council housing uh, and many other things that would be socially useful. And similarly on freedom of movement, uh, I think uh, Gerard Coyne's speech where he talked about immigration putting pressure on the NHS was a disgrace. Um, there's an, the NHS couldn't survive a day without uh, migrant workers and I thought Len McCluskey simply fudged the issue and I thought it was important that there was a voice in this election speaking up for the issues affecting members in the workplace and in our communities um, and uh, putting a clear left position.